Hi guys, it's just Janine. Thank you so much for coming. Hush! Welcome back to my channel. It's just Janine. Thank you so much for coming back and watching another one of my videos today. For those that are watching my video and tuning in for the very first time, welcome. And don't forget to click that subscribe button and also the notification bell so that way you'll be alerted about new videos that will be coming your way. And for those that have been with me since day one, welcome back. So today's video is very special, you guys. I am going to be straightening my hair for the very first time in three years. I've been three years natural, no heat, no chemicals, no nothing on my hair, nothing harmful, just a lot of washing and deep conditioning and treatments. That's pretty much it and keeping my hair curly and air drying my hair. So no blow dryers. The only time I used a, um, a actual, got under a, a blow dryer was a hair dryer rather I should say is when I do my deep conditioners and my hair is usually jam-packed with a lot of conditioners so it doesn't really you know harm my hair or anything like that. I never had the urge to do any type of heat. I never had the urge to straighten out my hair put perm in. None, none of that stuff. So all of a sudden I have an urge to straighten my hair. <laughs> I don't know where it came from but it just it just popped in my brain. What would my hair look like straight? Y'all are gonna be seeing this for the very first time. I'm gonna be seeing this for the very first time. You're gonna see my reaction. If I like it, if I don't like it. Um, I'm just hoping that the heat, just my hair takes to the heat uh, without any breakage or, or uh, damage, heat damage. So let me show you a couple things that I'm gonna be using for this video. So the first thing I have is the John Frieda flat iron and I've had this flat iron for quite some time. I actually got this flat iron years ago when I, when I was not natural, when I was permed and I was still wearing weave. So this is the iron and you can see it says John Frieda on the front. And then you'll notice here are the buttons for the um, levels of heat, which this one goes up to 480 and this is the little window that shows you the temperatures. And then of course on and off button. Now this flat iron is quite worn. It's pretty rusty and got all types of marks on it and damage from just being dropped and things like that. Um, it is not the best flat iron to use, but it's all I got. So hey, had to do what I had to do. The other thing that I had to get, which is a must to protect my hair, is a heat protectant. So I got the Garnier, uh, this is the Garnier Fruities Flat Iron Protector. It goes up to 450 on the heat protected and my flat iron goes up to 480 and I'm not trying to raise that heat up that high just to straighten out my hair. I'd rather go through a couple passes in order for it to straighten out than it to be that hot on my hair. So I'll do between 380 400 the most. I'm just going to part my hair into four sections. Um, then I'm just going to uh, start the video off just showing you how I do it, just normal speed, just flat out my hair, and then I'm just going to speed it up to get to the results. I'm just hoping for like really, really great results. So we're going to go ahead and get started, guys, because I don't want this to be a long, drawn out video. So let's get to it.
All right, guys, my hair is done. It is straight. <laughs> it's, um, yeah, I'll do it this way. I'll do it like this. So, yeah, my, my hair is nice and straight. Um, my thoughts, it straightened out well. Only thing I forgot about was when you put the, 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 um, what's this stuff? When you put this, this, uh, heat protected on your hair, when the flat iron hits it, your hair starts frying. And I was like, ah. whatever smart person designed this where you have to, you know, grip every time, every time you mash this or grip this or squeeze these flat irons, you're, it's changing the temperature. So that, I don't know what smart Brainiac person invented that, but that was horrible. It straightened out really well. Um, I like the results. I mean, it's something I could get away with for like a day maybe because my, my hair, the humidity here is still, you know, going to make my hair poof puff out. So I know I need my ends to be trimmed some more. It needs to be cut so I could, of course, tell that. Um, what else? The roots, I had a hard time getting to my roots because this, the, those flat irons are so hot. Like as soon as I put the spray on there, the heat protectant, and then the flat irons, it's hard to get the flat iron all the way to the roots. Even when you go through a couple times because the heat just sucks to your scalp and it singes your scalp. So I couldn't get really close to my roots like I wanted to. Will I straighten my hair again or will I keep it in this style? Absolutely not. <laughs> I miss my curly hair. I want my curly hair back. I don't miss straight hair. I just, I have never been able to wear my, my natural hair straight ever in life. It's just never worked out. And it's still, I'll show you the back. Yeah. It's, um... Yeah, it feels very light. It feels light. It feels feathery. So it did. It did do a decent job, I must say. But um, yeah, probably tomorrow I will be. Well, I'll let it. I'll wear it straight because nobody has seen my hair straight in a while. So I'll probably wear it to work like this. But I guarantee, when I go to sleep, I'm gonna put a bonnet on my head or my wrap it. I don't know. It's going to look a fool when I wake up in the morning. I already know. It's just not, yeah. <laughs> and I refuse to put any more heat on my hair. That's it. I'm not doing any more heat on my hair. Yeah. Let me get my, my, get my thumbnail. <laughs> but, yeah. Yeah. It is what it is, y'all. So, I hope y'all enjoy the video. I hope y'all enjoy watching me straighten my hair it was not fun i actually wanted to stop a couple times and stop the video and just be like you know what I'm, i can't do it no more i was really done by the time i got to the back I, honestly i was already done um when i got to the second um part of my hair i just wanted to shut the camera off and be like you know what guys i gave it a try but but I said, you know what, I'm, I'm just going to push through. I'm going to push through. I'm going to do this video. I want y'all to see all of my hair straight. If I do go back straight again, it'll be a long time. Because I need to wait and see what this heat does to my hair. If my hair starts breaking off or whatever in the next couple of days. But I'm going to make sure I really keep... Um, uh, moisture some type of moisture on my hair and stuff like that but it's going back curly that I guarantee is going back curly this is this this I can't go out in public like this y'all it's just like a hot mess it's, it's stiff it, it don't move it's just it's light and it's feathery but it just there's no body like look it don't move. So if you like this video, guys, please give a thumbs up. Please comment. Please subscribe. Please hit that notification bell and share with others if you enjoy the video. And if you would like to see other videos that I'm doing, please don't forget to subscribe and tell others that you know. It's just your name, y'all. Signing out. I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.